Did the president at any time ask you to stop the FBI investigation into Russian involvement in the 2016 U.S. elections? Not to my understanding, no. Did any individual working for this administration, including the Justice Department, ask you to stop the Russian investigation? No. The conversation back and forth about being, being a good guy. After that time, did the president ever bring up anything about Michael Flynn again to you? You had multiple other conversations you have documented with the president. No, I don't remember him ever bringing it up again. Did any member of the White House staff ever come to you and talk to you about letting go of the Michael Flynn case or dropping it or anything referring to that? No. Did, did it slow down your investigation or any investigation that may or may not be occurring with Michael Flynn? No. I don't think it's for me to say whether the conversation I had with the president was an effort to obstruct. He did not direct you to let it go. Not in his words, no. Was the president under investigation at the time of your dismissal on May 9th? No. I gather from all this that you're willing to say now that while you were director, the president of the United States w was not under investigation. Is that a fair statement? That's correct. On February 14th, when the New York Times wrote an article that suggested that the uh, Trump campaign was colluding with the Russians. You remember reading that article when it first came out? I do. It was about... Uh, allegedly extensive electronic surveillance. Theory. Correct. That report by the New York Times was not true. Is that a fair statement? Yeah, in the main, it was not true. The challenge, and I'm not picking on reporters, about writing stories about classified information is the people talking about it often don't really know what's going on, and those of us who actually know what's going on are not talking about it.